So today's video is brought to you by my very own coffee, Just A Dead Simple Sip Coffee. It's available in a K-cup, whole bean, and pre-ground 16 ounce bag. You can find it at justadadcoffee.com or right underneath the video, you will see the products displayed and you click on them and purchase them right there. Hello everyone, this is Just A Dad. Today I'm gonna do a review on this Tenneco One Floor S5 combo. Here I've got a really big mess. We're gonna see how it cleans that big mess up, but here it is on its charging station. Now this is your wet dry vacuum part, but we can also take this part off and attach it if we want like a little dust buster to pick up dry material only. So we've got this little release button here. You're gonna press that release button and then this comes off. It's gonna come off like this. Now I've got some controls right here. I can attach that and a crevice tool and I can clean up, vacuum up a dry mess. Then when I'm done, simply just turn it around, take that off, put it right here and snap that onto place. And now it's my wet dry vacuum. Now, when I'm using this as a wet dry vacuum cleaner, you're gonna turn it on right here and it's got auto and max. There is no solution button. It's gonna put the solution down automatically and then vacuum up the mess. The mess is gonna go into this chamber right here and around back, this is where the solution and the water go. Nice big holding tank there. Then when we're all done, we're gonna put it on the charging base and you're gonna press the self-cleaning button. We're gonna watch it do a, do a self-cleaning cycle. Now the nice thing about this is, see I've got some pet hair and some um, ketchup and some liquid and some cereal. It can pick up all of that together when you use it as this machine. It does wet and dry when you've got it in this assembly. When you wanna do just dry, like a little handheld vacuum, that's what this is for. It's got like a little chamber there, everything's gonna go into, take that little, uh, filter out and you can empty everything out So let's see how it cleans up this big mess Auto mode, I can go to max mode. See how that's turning red now? That tells me the floor is really dirty and it ramped up solution and suction. Now once it gets it clean, then it's gonna ramp the solution and suction back down. Again, all automatic, I'm not pressing the solution button. Now I can mop the rest of my floor. I can go to max mode. It's putting the maximum suction and solution down all the time. Turn it off. Again, take it over to the base. And there you go. It's charging. Auto detecting whether to run self-cleaning cycle. Please begin self-cleaning cycle. Okay, so it told me that it needs to do a self-cleaning. I'm simply gonna press this button, but I wanna make sure I got enough room. So down here, make sure that that is not full. Now I do have a little bit of room. This is the max line right here. So let's do a self-cleaning cycle. Self it's going to clean that brush roller. It's gonna put solution on it and have suction and it's gonna clean it. It's gonna take a little bit. Okay, so that took about two minutes. We're all done. Let's take the tank over to the sink. You're gonna empty this out. Self-cleaning cycle complete. Let's see how it did here. You know, I did a pretty good job. We got like a little bit of hair on here. So the self-cleaning cycle does a pretty good job. It cleans this, it cleans this little area right here. Now over here again, you're gonna take this off again. Sometimes you do have to clean this pretty good and that filter, but here we're gonna empty out everything. You can see it picks everything up and then I can rinse all of this out and get this all nice and clean. Okay, so now let's go pick up some dry material. Again, press this release button here, grab this. All I gotta do is put this on here like this, line up the electrical connection, snap it on the place. I can do a crevice tool, I can do this big tool, they snap on. My controls are right here, power, two modes of operation. So let's go pick up some dry material. Okay, so here we've got a mess. Again, this is only for dry material. I'm gonna put it on max. 
It's got a lot of suction. Very lightweight, very ergonomically fits in your hand. Okay, so let's see how well this did. Again, we're gonna take this off. This is very easy, just put it back into place, snap it into place. Now over here, I gotta take this out and then empty everything out. Once in a while, I will have to clean this. Again, this is only for dry material. And I can store it, snap it in. Now I can store it on this little base. Okay, so this retails for about $450. They do have it on sale for $379. Now, it does remind me of the S5 Blue, which is, that's the one I use every day. Um, it did a pretty good job. It's got some nice features. I do like the nice big water tank, nice big holding tank. This comes apart easy. It does edge cleaning on one side only. This side's pretty thick. Am I gonna use this part? I don't know. I would have actually thought the, this was gonna be kind of like on the machine so that I would just take this off, connect this, do some quick cleaning, take it off, put it on there. You know, this is gonna be in another room. It's gonna take up a little bit of room. I get why they did that. I'm not necessarily sure I'm gonna use this part the most. Um, it, did an, it does an okay job. Uh, it'd be nice if that had a roller brush on there that kind of got hair. If that got hair off of a uh, dog bed, th that would I really like that. So the Tenneco does a really good job. There, it did struggle with the hair a little bit around here on the self-cleaning cycle. I'm gonna start testing that more on these Tenecos is dog hair on them because I'm seeing now that that is a struggle area. Love that it charges on the base. Again, 379, yeah. I like that price point. 450 for this, unless you really, really wanna use this part. You know, it, it's very well made. It goes together very nice. You're not gonna have any problems like, it doesn't seem clunky. It doesn't seem like it was put together not very well. It all seems very well made. I like the auto mode. Uh, I like that it has that loop sense. Now it does connect to the Wi-Fi in your app. I've never found that to be that big a deal on these Tenecos. You can keep track of certain things on it, but I've just, it, it connects really easy to the app. I've just never really used, found that I like the features of it. I like the voice prompts. You can turn it on and off. Yeah, and this is just a really nice Tenneco. I will be comparing this to other Tenecos and some other cleaners, but Tenneco really has it figured out. Do I need a combo unit? I don't necessarily know that I need a combo unit, but if you do, it's very well made. You're gonna have these this thing you gotta keep off to the side, but this part of it, you're gonna like. So again, I will put a link to this underneath the show description notes. Again, if you could, please hit the thumbs up button. That really helps out my YouTube channel. Again, really appreciate everybody's support. So thanks everybody for watching my video today. Underneath the video, if you could hit the thumbs up button, that really helps out my YouTube channel. Again, you can purchase all this coffee right below the video. You'll see links to them or go to justadadcoffee.com. I really do appreciate everybody's support. Recently, YouTube just sent me my 100,000 subscriber plaque. That would not be possible without everybody's support. So again, I really appreciate it. I'm excited for this new adventure, branding my own coffee. Um, it, it tastes really good, and I hope you're gonna definitely like it again. Hoping somebody asks you what your favorite cup of coffee is. It's just a dad simple sip coffee. And again, thanks so much for watching the YouTube channel. Also, be sure and check out my Just A Dad videos group page on Facebook. This is where I do my free giveaways. So when I'm done with my products, I do a free giveaway on there, and you can kind of see behind the scenes of how I make my videos. Also, check out my podcast, Coffee With Dad Podcast. This is where I interview different people. I love to hear everybody's story, and I just think everybody has a story they want to tell. Hit the like, hit the subscribe button, and thanks so much. Miss Fiona always knows when I'm doing a recording. <laughs>